In a lot of ways, having a brewery that's a kind of regional brewery in Juneau, Alaska of all places, isn't the greatest place in the world to think about. Where would I put a brewery? Matter of fact, one of the pumps that we have right now is down today, so we gotta get a little creative. And that would be something worth mentioning too about uniqueness in, in Juneau is that uh, we don't have the specialties that you would expect down south, so it's not as simple as calling somebody, hey man, my pump's leaking, can you come fix it? In Juneau, you, you sort of have to be that guy for everything. Shipping. The challenges are mostly centered around shipping and getting anything that we need here. Um, we will sacrifice an incredible amount of profit margin to make a beer that tastes a little bit better. But the positives far outweigh that, which uh, the people of Juno and our customers are extremely passionate about our products, very excited about all the new things that we do, and it makes it well worth it to continue to operate a brewery in a, in a little town in Alaska. So the first bottle of amber rolled off the line day after Christmas in 1986. By 1987, Great American Beer Festival, Amber, this beer, Amber, won the overall best beer in the land in Great American Beer Festival. So you can imagine for two young people to start a brewery in Juneau, Alaska of all places, to within a year be recognized as having the best beer in the land. That was a huge landmark. We're very focused on fun lifestyles here and the fun lifestyles that we lead have to be intertwined with the outdoors. Access to clean, natural, neutral water. In a lot of other places, they have to add or delete chemical compounds in their water in order to make the beer that they want and to make the flavor profile that, that they want. And here, we don't have to do much. There's a spirit of innovation this community has been about. Every first Friday, we try and host a local artist. We give them a chance to hang up their art. Uh, it brings in a lot of people every Friday. It gives them a chance to sell their art. It's something that I'm really proud of is to collaborate with so many different artists around the state and just highlighting their work. The brewing industry is a pretty cool community because overall, uh, there's, a, there's a real community atmosphere. We just love having fun and we want to always reflect that.